Hey guys, we're going to talk a little bit about a stamp that we call the Original Random. It was the first random stone that we've done. Uh, we have several since then, uh, but this is this is the main one, and they all work the same. Uh, what the stamp is, three different patterns, nice rustic field stone, uh, three-eighths to a half-inch grout line. Uh, there is a couple stones that are aggressive, so it does give you a rustic look, uh, but overall it's not too bad. It's, it's relatively flat. And with any random stone, they don't look like you can do straight lines, but you can. As you can see, you can create a fairly straight line. Then when you come up to your next row, you grab the stamp, kind of hover a little bit so you can drop it in place. Kind of hover it and drop it into place. And then just continue on. Very traditional, very common stamp. With any Walt Tool stamp, you're going to get your trusty touch up skin that matches and your floppy. Touch up tools that you use for this skin are the 3 8 grout roller or the 3 8 size hand grout tool off by Walt Tools. Thank you. And remember, the guide to the number of pieces is you want to have enough stamps to go across your pour and then have another stamp to start the next row. So if your pour is 20 feet wide, and that's the direction you're going, you need 20 feet of stamps and one stamp to start your next row.